Rick Moranis is back. The comedy legend has been out of the spotlight for the past two decades, but he's making his grand return for the new Disney project, Shrunk. It's a reboot of Rick's beloved 90s franchise, Honey, I Shrunk the Kids. As Deadline first reported, the same director who did the original film, Joe Johnson, what? will be back. What? And Josh Gad is on board Josh to play Rick's character. Josh Gad! Long Bro! Fan of Rick's. And he's Bro, he's back! Buster Star's big return. Yeah, Rick Moranis! Rick Moranis so, is back! Been sitting on this one for It's called Shrunk! To say it is a dream I love reboots. To once again see I love Hollywood. On the big this screen. is amazing. Seriously, just left my wallet in the car. That's awesome. Holy moly. Oh, God. <sighs> Jesus. All right, what's up, guys? On a very, very wet day, we're back with another wing review. Let me put this light on. Come on. All right. That's got to be better. Ooh, baby, that's professional. All right, I'm soaked. I'm soaked. It's been raining in Atlanta four days, and I wanted to kind of time this so that I could eat the wings on the wing or the wings on the wheel like I normally do, and it won't stop raining. So we're working with what we got, and I'm soaking wet, and I just wanted some wings, and we're here. We are at Otter's Chicken. This is in uh, Atlanta, Georgia. This is the Cumberland location. There's four around the city, so I guess it's kind of like a small-time local chain thing. Their hottest flavor is called Crazy Hot with three exclamation points. <laughs> That's saying something. Crazy Hot with three exclamation points. <laughs> now you're flirting with me. Let's see what they look like. Woo, baby! They're hot. Fresh out of the fryer. Okay, they smell like regular buffalo, but we'll see. Here's what they look like. All right. I'm gonna have to let these cool off a little bit. All right, I'm gonna let these cool off and I'm gonna explain the scoring system from here on out. A buddy of mine hit me up. He said, dude, you're being too lenient. Your goal with this whole thing is to find the legit hot sauces around town. Don't be giving out sevens all willy-nilly. And I thought about it, and I was like, you know what? You're right. So here's what we're doing moving forward. A five, that's your everyday average buffalo wing. Nothing special. Not bad, not great, not too hot. Anything below a five, don't even worry about it. If you manage to score a six, that's something where it's like a little bit hotter than a regular buffalo. Maybe I like the way the wing crunches. Maybe I like the juiciness about it. Maybe I just had a good experience to get you up to a six. Now when we get into the sevens, we're getting legitimately a little bit hotter. That's something like, you know, it's it's not it's not going to blow the roof off the house, but it's still going to be something that will uh, you'll feel the tingling on your lips a little bit, right? I'm going to call it Tarzan Boy Hot. Why am I going to call it Tarzan Boy Hot? Because it's going to make you go... And then if you're an eight, that's Little Richard's hot. Why is it Little Richard's hot, guys? Because it makes you go. And now if you're a nine, here's the biggest difference. If you if we happen if we somehow find a nine anywhere, that's a certified overheated wing. I started the website overheated.me overheated.me there's a wing section and I'm gonna have I'm gonna list out the certified overheated wing places there okay we've given this a chance to cool off let's eat these wings now we're gonna start with a drum a drum um, otters chicken crazy hot three exclamation points <laughs> Well, 
they are juicy, but not much of a crisp on the outside. This was the hottest flavor they had. Um, <laughs> I gotta tell you, I've done how many of these videos now? If you have all you, if you have so many flavors, why can't you make your hottest one something exciting? Now, if you can't tell, I'm not excited right now. This is their hottest flavor. I mean, the wings have a good size, don't get me wrong. It was $7 for five. No dip, obviously. I ain't, I ain't dipping my wings. I already know where I'm going with this one. This is a 5.4. These are, these are basic, man. Don't call it crazy hot if it's just regular buffalo. I had high hopes for this one. I really thought. There's something about the naming convention. You know, you see those three exclamation points and you're thinking, that one might get me. That one might get me. Nope. All right, that's it. That's the wing review for today. I don't know when it's gonna stop raining. Here we go. My wings were in hot, but I'm still happy. Can you even see that? Probably not. Thanks guys. That's the review for today. See you next time.